Hello friends, welcome to Susan and John MathTube. In this video, we learn about the reciprocal system of vectors. Okay, so remember you should be able to evaluate the scalar triple product before you start this. And you should be very good with the theory for vector triple product and scalar triple product if you want to do the problems comfortably. Okay, so uh, they might ask the definition, so make sure you learn the definition properly. So the first thing we want is three non-coplanar vectors. Do you still remember what is the condition for coplanar vectors? Yeah, STP will be equal to zero. So if the vectors are non-coplanar, the STP will be non-zero. Okay, so we consider three non-coplanar non vectors and then the vectors A dash, B dash and C dash given by, it's very easy to remember, uh, you remember the cycle A and then B and then C. Okay, A dash is given by B cross C by a, B, C and B dash is given by, so look at, look at B and tell me the next two vectors C and D, C cross A by STP and C dash is equal to, tell me the next two vectors A cross B, the whole divided by STP is called the reciprocal system. So remember a, B, C and A dash, B dash, C dash are called reciprocal system. Okay, let's start with the simple question. Okay, the first one is like if A, B, C and A dash, B dash, C dash are reciprocal systems, then prove that A dot A dash plus B dot B dash plus c dot c dash is equal to 3. Okay, so it's very easy. Uh, all you have to remember is the values of a dash, b dash and c dash. And I told you it's very easy to remember if you remember a, b, c in the cyclic order. Okay, so what we do is we start with the left hand side. So tell me, what is the left hand side? A dot, what is A dash? Very, very simple. Tell me the vectors which come after A, B and C. So it will be B cross C divided by A, B, C. If you want, you can use bracket. Plus B dot, come on, what is B dash? You look at the next two vectors. C cross A divided by plus C dot, what will be C dash? Of course, A cross B by STP. Now, uh, look at this. <clears throat> Always remember, the scalar triple product is a number. And you can always take the number as a common factor. You don't have to care whether it is dot product or ordinary addition or cross product this will come outside this from the very basic vectors you learned long back now tell me the remaining part a dot b cross c plus b dot c cross a plus c dot a cross b so that will be 1 by STP and I hope you already understood what is this. It's an STP. What is that STP? ABC. And what is this? Another STP. And what is this? Okay, so what we do is we will do cyclic interchange. Always remember cyclic interchange means two times interchanging and it will work like a belt. So what I'm doing is I'm going to push A, I'm going to put A here and push the other two. And here I'm going to push 
and take c to the last uh, if you are uh, if you are worried to or if you are getting confused with the cyclic interchange then you can imagine we are doing in uh, we are doing two interchanges can you see first of all i am converting or transforming a into b and b into a then i am transforming b into c and c into b that means negative of negative anyway i feel this cyclic interchange to be very comfortable while doing problems and in examination i told you in on previous video itself presentation should be very very neat so you get 1 by stp abc into 3 times abc i am not simplifying that is equal to 3 that's exactly what we had to prove now one very 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 important question uh, we will come to the simple questions afterwards uh, look at this this is one of the most repeated type of question in stp so what they do is they ask you to find the reciprocal system so write the question find the set of reciprocal system for the vectors 2i plus 3j minus k minus i plus 2j minus 3k uh, please write the question carefully in examination don't make any mistake with plus or minus and the last vector 3i minus 4j plus 2k okay the first thing you are going to do is you are going to call the vectors as a b and c so what's the first thing to do you call the vectors as a b c and then you can write let the required reciprocal system be a dash b dash and c dash where a dash is equal to b cross c by i think you now remember a b c b dash is equal to c dash is equal to in examination it is always uh, good to write the definition because in case there is any calculation mistake at least at least you will get one mark for this okay so we have we have to calculate b cross c c cross a a cross b and then our stp so that's it so it's so easy so we start with the stp come on come on we have done so many problems so now i'm sure that you remember how to evaluate an stp easily determinant 2 3 minus 1 minus 1 2 minus 3 3 minus 4 2 you can evaluate it here then what we do is we go for b cross c do you remember cross product i'll help you with it if you want to find the cross product the first row in the determinant will be i j k the second row will be components of b which happens to be minus 1 2 minus 3 i hope you copied the question see and the last row will be for c which is 3 minus 4 so you can evaluate it here and then comes c cross a tell me how do you write c cross a determinant i j k what is c 3 minus 4 2 and then a 2 3 minus 1 you can confirm it 3 minus 4 2 2 3 minus 1 now the last one a cross b that will be determinant i j k and then comes 2 3 minus 1 minus 1 2 minus 3 okay you can evaluate it um, anyway the answers that i got i will put it here i got my answer to be minus 35 i did it in a bit i did it a bit fast so please make sure you do it slowly and confirm this you can do it in a calculator also uh, you can find the cross products dot products everything in calculator i got minus 8i minus 7j minus 2k and the next one minus 2i 
plus 7j plus 17k and the third one minus 7i plus 7j plus 7k so now tell me what is a dash so you can write a dash is equal to b cross c you go for b cross c okay so that is minus 8i minus 7j minus 2k the whole divided by minus 35 you can simplify a little bit if you want now b dash is equal to by minus 35 c dash is equal to nothing by minus 35 okay now practice a lot of problems based on this this is kind of like very important okay another important question that i saw in the question papers which was a little bit challenging um, okay it goes like this if a b c and a dash b dash c dash are reciprocal systems then prove that a dash cross b dash plus b dash cross c dash plus c dash cross a dash is equal to a plus b plus c whole divided by stp provided the stp do not vanish or non co uh, what you call non coplanar coplanar means stp is zero non coplanar means stp is not equal to zero okay so let's give it a try so what we do is we start with uh, the left hand side and like what you call once you start itself you will understand that uh, like what you call the the formula for product of four vectors is involved in this the formula for product of four vectors is involved in this are you, are you able to see that okay so it is better to write the product of four vector formula in examination if you feel like deriving it you can derive it so a cross b cross c cross d there are two formulae anyway i'll try it with my first formula what's the first formula a b d c minus a b c d and what's the second formula a c d b and then b c d a okay so this one you have to derive in exam if you don't know the derivation at least uh, remember this okay now let's start with the left hand side a dash cross b dash what is a dash a dash is b cross c divided by stp cross what is b dash b dash will be c cross a divided by plus b dash means c cross a divided by stp cross c dash will be a cross b divided by stp plus a dash will be b cross c divided by stp okay now always 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 remember the fact that this is a number these things are numbers and i told you you can take common factor you don't have to care whether it is addition cross product dot product etc so we are going to get one by stp squared got it this will be square 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 so that comes common okay now the remaining part will be b cross c cross c cross a plus c cross a cross a cross b plus a cross b cross b cross okay now tell me how to apply the formula so 1 by stp abc come on tell me the formula for four vectors and remember there are two possible cases we discussed in the last video yeah so i'm going to apply the formula so it will be like b c a c 
minus B C C A. Okay, finally some good news. I hope you already understood. We did a lot of videos in STP. So if you have watched those things and practice properly, you'll know why I put that red. Plus, what's the next STP? C A B A minus C A A B. So again good news because this is going to come on think about it why am I putting it in red yeah it will be zero plus the next vector that will be a b c b minus a b b c so the good news is all that red color vectors will become zero and the remaining things you can uh, interchange you can do some cyclic interchange this will become abc if you push it this side it will become abc this is already abc so abc comes common so we end up with one by stp squared and stp will come common and the remaining part is a plus b plus c and that is exactly what we are trying to prove. Okay, that's it. It was a very small video. I'll be back with more videos related to uh, this STP. And the next video will be the last in triple products and related videos. And after that, we will go for vector differentiation and integration. So till then, my friends, bye.